love bugs and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna do something a little different. New for the channel, I think we'll start a little series here and basically what it's gonna be is my favorites for the last quarters. We'll call this one winter favorites. And I'll start doing these like every quarter and I'm just gonna talk about whatever I feel like talking about and whatever I've used and I've really fallen in love with those past three months. So, without further ado, if you're new here, I'm Sarah, and I help teach people find inner happiness through fitness and spirituality. And today, we're gonna get down with Sarah's favorites. <laughs> I promise I won't sing a lot on this channel, but you know, it might come out sometimes. I'm not good. I know you don't have to tell me. It's fine. <laughs> so first we're gonna start with some snacks because who doesn't like snacks? I do. As far as like diet goes, you know, we'll get into this further on this channel, but I do really eat a clean diet, but I do love my freaking snacks. All the snacks I'm going to show you aren't like 100% clean or vegan or gluten-free or dairy-free or blah, 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 blah. They're just healthier alternatives that I eat. Bottom line, that's it. So, let's get started. You guys are gonna make fun of me for this one because everyone in my life has been making fun of me for this, but it is what it is. If you follow me on Twitter, I just can't help it. I have been weirdly obsessed with beets. I, I don't know. These actually aren't even the ones that I usually eat. I usually have the ones that are already soaked in vinegar. But to tell you the truth, I went to two grocery stores today and they didn't have the beets that I typically like. I'll pop them up right here. So those are the ones I always get. I got these plain ones. They're just cooked beets and I got my own apple cider vinegar to soak them in. I've never done it before, so we shall see how it goes. I'll throw it up maybe on like Instagram or TikTok or something. These are freaking awesome. All veggies, all fruits, all natural fruits are obviously awesome. There's so many different ways to eat beets. I've eaten them where I don't like them. I've eaten them where I do. And especially if you have them pickled and soaked in vinegar, you're getting all the um, probiotics that come with it. So I highly suggest to eat some beets. As my roommates say, it leaves a bloodbath everywhere and they know when I eat them because they say I leave a trail of the juice. But I just can't help it, they're so tasty. And I honestly crave them, I crave them all the time. I was doing one of my 40 hour fasts a week or two ago and I literally just wanted my pickled beets the entire time, that was, that was all I wanted. I just wanted the beets and it was like the first thing I ate after my fast was broken. So if you've never tried beets, I mean honestly, I didn't start eating them until like a year ago and then within the last few months I just I just want them every single day every day I couldn't eat these when I was on keto so I love you beat <laughs> all right let's get into the sweets now because I got a sweet tooth yes I do I'm obsessed with these I eat them all the time. There's only one place I know where you can get it if you're on the East Coast and it's not even all of the East Coast if you're in parts of the East Coast you know what Wawa is. Now where I live, it's all sheets. If you're from this area, you know the sheets versus Wawa battle. I am here to tell you, Wawa is better. And Wawa has chocolate covered chickpeas. Like chocolate covered chickpeas. Like, oh. And also, while you're sitting there wondering is Sheets better? Is Wawa better? Make sure to like this video. <laughs> They're so good. They have milk chocolate and dark chocolate. I'm a milk chocolate kind of gal. And what I really, really love about these, and I've always been a big chickpea fan, is that they're sweetened. I'm so glad I chose this snack second. I, did, I Once I know I, I, I cleared a snack, like once I know 
it's a healthier alternative as far as like whatever sugar they use to sweeten it with. I just, sometimes I just forget what it is. <laughs> they use beet sugar, beet sugar to sweeten this. That's what it is. So you're looking at chickpeas, cocoa butter, cocoa powder, beet sugar, vanilla, and, and milk powder. I mean, that's all that's in here and they are good. So if you're near a Wawa, try them. If you're not, you can probably order them online. I happened to be near a Wawa about an hour away the other day. And whenever I'm near a Wawa, I pick some up. Next, we're going to go with my OG company, the OG fitness brand that I've loved since day one. They came out with these bars a few months ago. And ever since then, I've been freaking addicted. You're looking at the Quest snack bars. I believe they have 10 grams protein, one gram of sugar. Quest seriously freaking kills it every time. Ugh. I just love Quest. I just love Quest. I always have all their products are always just bomb. This is just a nice quick snack, 10 grams of protein. You got some fiber in here, some carbs, a little bit of fat, low, low, low sugar, barely any sugar alcohols. This is a fantastic, fantastic snack. I think they run around $2.50 or so. I usually buy them by the box, so I have them on hand. But they have a few different flavors. The peanut butter chocolate is to die for. So if you want something that's on the go, you're on the go a lot, I would highly suggest picking some of these babies up. This last snack is a healthier alternative. It's not healthy. It's a healthier alternative. So don't be commenting below and being like, Sarah, it's not healthy. I know. I know it's not. I know it's not. Okay. But it's a better alternative and I'm addicted. I'm addicted. The fish is the way to go. They have probably six or seven different types of gummies. I like the fit. I like all of them, but for the price, it's a little pricey. It's usually around three bucks a bag. The fish are the way to go. Now I will warn you, I will warn you, do not eat more than one bag. I can sometimes get a bag and a half down in one sitting or one day. This is pretty much 100% fiber. A lot of people that are on the keto diet get upset. They say, ooh, it's not keto. They don't claim to be keto. They are low carb, they are low sugar. They're sweetened with allulose, but they're freaking amazing. I mean, I love regular Swedish fish and I just, you know, feel a little bit better about myself if I choose these instead. 18 grams net carbs. So if you're on keto, that's your carbs for the whole day, but otherwise, Great, great, low carb, low sugar snack. If you're really, really wanting some sweets, I pretty much always have these on hand, but I know if I have them on hand, I'll just eat them. So I try not to go too crazy about them. So that's it for the snacks. Let's pop into my fave workout gear. As many of you know that have followed me for a long time, whether it is on YouTube or Instagram, whether it was my old account before it got hacked or my newer account that I started a little less than a year ago, Y'all know, y'all know I'm obsessed with Buff Bunny. I love Buff Bunny clothes. I'm not sponsored by Buff Bunny. I would die if I was. <laughs> they are a fitness brand that started by Heidi Summers. She is known as Buff Bunny on social media platforms and they came out, I believe in 2016. And they're a launch based company. I think I've bought at least one piece from every single launch. Really wanted to show you guys the two pieces they're matching that I just absolutely love. We've got this baby here. I love the back. They are just such stunning pieces. They give you great shape, great support. And I get compliments on this set all the time. It's just plain. It's just a matching set. I believe this is the Arctic blue color. I'd have to double check on that. Okay. But what I really like about the bottoms is one, they are high waisted and seamless. So you don't have a little seam at the top. It's not gonna, you know, squeeze, squeeze you out a little bit. And it has a little bit of tummy control. So it is a little more high waisted. And then you have this, you know, little detail in the back to, you know, accentuate your bum a little bit, you know? It's 
it's fine it's fine so that was like the number one set I really liked getting this quarter from them I also have one more set to show you guys that I really love the pants are actually in the wash right now but I do have the bra and the pants are just matching but this is the other set that I got from them that I absolutely adore I think the shape once you put it on is just absolutely beautiful it's different I mean obviously you can see it has the band here so I don't love wearing this set if I'm feeling a little fluffy you know but otherwise stunning if you haven't checked out Buff Bunny before and you're looking for some nice workout clothes I would say their quality is you know impeccable just like Lululemon half the price still a little pricey but I'll tell you guys what like I still have a lot of the pieces I have from like four or five years ago so definitely worth the investment plus they're cute they're supportive and um, you know they make you feel great in the gym so check them out and then I know this is far from a beauty channel but I'm still a freaking woman so I want to show you guys some of the products I have three products here that I've been using a lot over the past three months that I've just completely fallen in love with the first one is this little tart eyeshadow set I'm actually wearing one of the colors right now I love the browns the blacks I'm wearing the rocker right now if you can see that I'm definitely a big eyeshadow gal I'm really picky about eyeshadow because it comes off very easily and I also put liquid liner on and sometimes if it's not the right type of shadow it gets kind of bumpy especially when you have all of the sparkle and glitter inside of the shadow so these go on really smooth they last pretty much all day I absolutely love Tarte um, I'm, I'm a little newer to their brand but I've been using their eyeshadows for probably about a year now and I just scooped this one up about a month ago so it's the Tarte in Bloom palette okay the next product I'm going to share with you guys is called the Physicians Formula Lip Polish look I'm not a makeup gal but this stuff is on freaking point so let's let it uh, let it focus there a little bit so you see that so all you do is take a little scooper you it's kind of like a almost feels like a sugar scrub to a to a certain extent you rub it all on your lips and then you immediately just take a paper towel and rub it off and it basically removes all the dead skin from your lips, especially right now in the winter months when we're get, we're a little drier. I know my lips get super dry. It's very annoying. They don't get like cracky, but they get like, you know, I don't know. I just don't like it. So this stuff has been a game changer. What I like to do is use it at night before I go to bed. And then when my lips were kind of, are kind of really raw after using it and scrubbing off that dead skin, you can like feel the difference. I throw some Vaseline on there and go to sleep. And in the morning they're like brand new lips. <laughs> and while you're pursing your lips and you're polished, make sure to subscribe. Subscribe didn't pop, but you know, it'll help me out. So thank you. <laughs> and the last product I'm going to share with you guys today, I kind of mentioned in my last video, the microblading versus micro shading. And that is this non water face wash. I'll tell you what, this stuff was a game changer. I will be using this a lot moving forward when I'm traveling, going to festivals, when I do have to get my eyebrows retouched. I mean, it's really, I can't pronounce it, so I'll show you guys a little bit again. It's some French name, I don't know. But basically, if you pop it open, it comes out kind of like a lotion. And you just put it on like you would with regular face wash. And you take a little damp cotton ball or something along those lines. And you literally just wash it off. It takes your makeup off and everything. I mean, this is sick stuff, bro. And I do have one little um, bonus. And for a lot of you that have followed me for a long time, you know that I have suffered from chronic headaches for... <sighs> 10, 15 years, I mean, a long time. And I started seeing a chiropractor back in July, so we're coming up on a year here in a few months, and since then, I really haven't had many, I don't know if I had a few drinks the night before, but my aunt got me this for Christmas, this little guy, in here. 
it has been amazing for my headaches. You put it on your pressure point on your thumb, like this. Ah, kind of gives me the heat jeebie a little bit. And if you keep that on there, I swear to God, I always rate my headaches on a one to 10 scale. This will lower you like three to four points and you just switch them back and forth between your hands on, the, on that pressure point. You'll know once you get to it. I mean, I can feel it right here. It's amazing. So if you suffer from headaches, I highly, highly suggest subscribing to this channel. <laughs> I highly suggest you go and grab one of these. I'm pretty sure it's got to be under $10 or something, but it's been a game freaking changer. So with that being said, I hope you guys liked this little spice up of a video. I know I've been switching it up lately, but I am who I am. And you know what? I'm not just a fitness person. I'm not just a nutrition person. I'm not just a spiritual person. I got lots of interests. I got lots of things I like. I got lots of things I like to talk about. So that's what this channel is. So I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Let me know in the comments below what product you're thinking about trying. And honestly, if you want to see more of these favorites videos, because if you don't, I won't post them. If you do, I will. So let me know. I freaking love you guys to the moon. And don't forget, be limitlessly yourself.